Hey, value traders, did you see this huge drop in the US dollar? Value Trades. I'm Brad Alexander, and in this week's Market Blast Fundamentals, let's take a look at the S&P 500, gold, euro dollar, Swiss yen, dollar Swiss, and dollar yen. Every once in a while, an event happens that completely upends the markets. The collapse of the Silicon Valley Bank has done just that for two reasons. Firstly, the idea that more banks might fail has driven investors to safe havens like the Japanese yen, and we see the results. We can also see the strength in the Swiss franc, which is also a traditional safe haven, with the US dollar Swiss franc falling to 0.916 at this key level of support. So, if we have two traditional safe havens, it is not unusual for traders to see which one is winning. Therefore, if we look at Swiss Yen, we see the Swiss franc clearly ahead since the beginning of January. Secondly, the collapse of the SVB and other banking issues have had the US Federal Reserve rethinking the next rise in interest rates, thereby making the US dollar weaker. You know where I'm going with this. Gold is now higher, both as a safe haven and as a reaction to the weaker US dollar. Euro dollar is behaving like all the US dollar pairs, but be aware that we have some very important economic news this week as we expect the ECB to raise interest rates by 0.5%. Expect volatility. Looking at the US indices, it seems that some investors are less worried about the collapse of a bank or two and more impressed by the concept of lower interest rates. All US indices are higher today on a risk on mood. Thanks for watching and don't forget to subscribe to Value Trade Signals and the link will be in this video's description below. Also, subscribe to our YouTube channel and register on the Value Trades website to get notifications on new content as it happens. That's all for now. Happy trading with Value Trades, and we will see you next time. CFDs and FX are leveraged products, and your capital may be at risk.